should have got up earlier. Oh dear me. Decided. Take the way out to Bradgate Park quick. It's about a 35, 40 minute drive from where I live. Got the dog out to come out for a while. She's probably here in the back. So hopefully don't shoot me coat this time. Cooper quiet. Um, I've got a bit of kit I want to try out. And Bradgate Park's a perfect place for it. So off we go. Yeah. I might even, tomorrow looks a better morning, so I might get up early tomorrow. I'm going to try and get a sunset with the Mr. Sunset. This, this bit of kit's really for photographing the deer and wildlife. But still open to get a landscape shot as well. Tomorrow's supposed to be a bit of mist. Today's more, a little bit more overcast. So, I thought, why not? Paint the dog out for a while. Need to run. Just love getting up early. I can't out every morning, every weekend morning when I'm off work. I can't out, but just think, what's the weather going to be like? Can I get out? I'm going to be bothered to get out. Um, Normally, if I don't get out, I'm gutted. But uh, I've got a very busy day after I come from here, so I thought, let's get it over and done with. I've got loads to do today, so. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a deer park, and there's, there's in the morning, there's deer everywhere. And I'm going to try and get a photograph of this deer. It's, uh, Thank you. 
to mow this way, I've got to crop some waters, which is at the end of Bradgate Park, around the, around the roadway. Well, I'm on my way to Bradgate Park and I've just seen that scene so I've pulled over grabbed myself a quick photo and I think I've got a beauty I'm really pleased already I ain't even there yet really pleased oh. fantastic what a lovely morning gosh I should have got up earlier Oh dearie me, how many times do I say it? Get up early. Come on. We've arrived. Oh. Uh, normally the parking here, I think it's four pound, but I can't pay because it's locked up. So I normally pay when I come back, so it's worth it. And I think we should. Let's wait for the dog. Good luck. Oh, this way. Um. Yeah. So uh, we'll pay when we get back. Up, uh, we definitely should have got up earlier. It was, you look out the window and you think, it's going to be rubbish. It just shows you, ten minutes later, the uh, sky all lights up. And there was a little bit of distant mist. So we would have got some cracking shots, but like I said, I've just pulled over. I think I've got a couple of beauties. Just to sort of finish off them summer shots, I suppose. Go back, wait. Got me Kirkle Wears. He loves it here. Go watch go watch the dogs with the deer. Can't let the dogs chase the, the deer. So even though they chase them kill the deer so make sure at the top here you can let it off the lead even though there's deer up here you can let them off but obviously if it gets too close um, I'll put him back on so there's a wall that sort of divides the park it's quite a big park there's a wall that divides it and uh, if uh, it'll be on the wall it's got to be on the lead so, which makes sense. Come on, then, mate, let's get in. Great for night photography. Ooh, I'm chugging out, aren't I? Ooh, some more whiffs. Uh, you can't see any deer at the minute. Normally they're up here, up the top, and then they'll move out the other side of the, the river as the people come. Which way shall I go? I think I'm going to go up the back here towards the monument. Yeah, we've got a monument, we've got the old John. Loads, loads, loads. Loads of scope. 
Yes, this is the this is the bit of equipment Tom I'm looking at. Oh. I shall show you more detail in a minute when I stop. Right, let the dog off the lead so he's not pulling me. So this is the bit of kit. So uh, Tamron 150 to 600. Uh, it is for. It's right, so I see. Bit of composition there. Uh, it is for mat loop, that type of thing. They do have a lot of deer here. That's ideal for that. I'm really just trying to out, see what it's like. Um, we are going like expensive, thousands of pounds. This is the kit to have. Hopefully, got good reviews. Uh, I'm hoping to try it out on a few deer. Got an image stabiliser, which will help. So let's go and find some some deer and if I do see a landscape composition I will be stopping so I know I can find the deer even if I walk around, down to the river again going across I just want to try it out and see what how sharp it is and quick focus and then when you're doing the mat loop obviously with the uh, the jets flying by must be a very quick sh uh, focus which it is I've got it on my 60D crop sensor auto the auto ISO 200th of a second I think for now and then I'll change that as I go along really I'll setting it that so I know I'll get my photo and then we'll, uh, we'll learn from there Just realised now I've let the dog off the lead. Um, if I can't get any deer, I've still got subject the dog. So I can always try it out on that. Sometimes you can just, just walk in and next minute you know there's a big stag staring at you. What I've got to do is make sure I find it before the dog does. Without a doubt, and it is um, rutting season soon. I think it's mid October. I think uh, I know they do do courses, photography courses for all that type of thing. I suppose it'd be quite good, but I'm sure they'll put it on the internet, it's all booked up. But if you're interested in that, I suppose the best thing to do is go on the forum website, just check that out. I'm sure I've seen that it's booked up. So obviously quite popular. I've spotted two or four deer. And it looks I'm sure the deer. I'm a good way away. So we're right for a minute and I've got a dog on legs in it. And I'm sure they're rutting. I'm pretending. They're a good, good way away. They're about right there. Then there's some people just in front of them, so they don't disturb them. Seem to be moving one, which is unusual for them, really. It's quite slow. I'm sure, they're rutting. This could be a good day. Well, you wouldn't believe it. I've just had them have a little play rut, I think it was. So, what I'm going to do is, I was up above them, I'm going to try and get a 
shot more level with them. Uh, there are three of them. Nice. Two nice big deer. They're, they're more playing, I think, for the big day. <laughs> But I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get onto this. They're actually on the, a little path here. They're getting quite close to us. They don't want to speak, spoken too much. We're 30 meters away. Got the dog here. It's not being good. Oh, sorry, pulling me the wrong way. Right, we're on the path. On the path now. One's right on the path, so I'm gonna get him. I could do him looking up. Let me just put you down. Yeah, man.